If only a web series that looks at interesting people. If only looks at Sadayako, Sadayako Kawakami, or just simply known as Sadayako. A Japanese geisha, actress and dancer from the 1800s. If only, then, then. Kamibukai Hitobito Nai Kumoksur Uebusiazu. Mitame Zie Sadeko, Kawakami Sadeko, Matawa Taichiju Inyofu Nai Sadeko Nai Mieru Dakenara Sen Hapiaku, Nendai no Nihon no Geisha, Joit Dance. Sadeyako or Sadeyako was a Japanese geisha, actress and dancer. Sadeyako Kawakame was born July 18, 1971, the youngest of 12 children to a Japanese merchant family that ran a book shop and currency exchange. Her family fell on financially hard times because of heavy taxes and inflation. The family opened a pound business to help make ends meet. When Sada was four years old, she was sent to work as a maid at the Hamada Geisha House in the Yoshich district of Tokyo. Three years later, Sada's father, Hisejo Koyama, died, leading the Hamada's proprietress, Kimikichi, to adopt Sada as her heir. At the tender age of 12, she became an apprentice geisha, and her name changed with this new position in life. She became known as Koyako or Little Yako, named after a geisha named Yako who had been one of the most adored in Tokyo. Kimikichi felt sure that little Yako would grow up to be as brilliant a star in her turn. Kimikichi wanted Koyako's career as a geisha to be resplendent, as it would mean more money for the geisha house, so she was sent her to a Shinto priest to learn how to read and write. Geisha usually were illiterate, and only women of the nobility were allowed to learn how to read and write. Koyako took advantage of being a geisha by using her freedom it gave her to take taboo lessons in judo, play billiards, and learn how to ride horses. The newspaper gossip columns of the day reported that she also rode horses in professional horse races. When Koyako was 15, her mesoeji was sold to then Prime Minister Itharabimi. The selling of her mesoeji was part of her coming of age and graduation, a ceremony undergone by Apprentice Kamuro and some Meko as part of their coming of age ceremony and graduation. Having had her mesoeji sold to the then Prime Minister, this new prestigious patron caused her popularity to increase at the tea houses and she took on a new name, Yako. In addition to increased popularity, she found a new talent. Acting. Kabuki is a classical form of Japanese theater, mixing dramatic performance with traditional dance. Traditionally, only men were allowed to act in Kabuki, but Yako was allowed to act because she had friends in high places. The path to acting also led to her meeting her future husband, the famous comedian and actor 27-year-old Otojo Kawakami, who had his own acting troupe touring Japan. She was immediately drawn to him, and set her mind to making him her own. October 1893, Yako and Otojo were married, with a mutual friend, Baron Kentaro Kaneko, as the official go-between. The marriage was a bumpy one. Otojiro was not able to manage their finances, constantly running from debtors, fathering a child with a court sin, finally caused the couple to pick up and try to leave their problems behind by moving to Kobe. In Kobe they met Yumindu Kashibiki, a businessman who had made his fortune building a Japanese tea garden in Atlantic City, New Jersey, and bringing Japanese entertainment and goods to the United States. Kashibiki wanted to bring authenticity to his American tea houses by way of Japanese theater, he decided to sponsor Otojiro's troupe to come to America. Koshibiki promoted Yako in San Francisco before they arrived as being the star of the show and compared her to well-known famous actresses in America, giving the newspapers the impression that she was just as famous or more famous than her American counterparts. This launched Yako's career in America and also another name change, she was given the stage name Sadeako and debuted by performing the death scene from the Maiden at Gigi Temple, which she had performed in Kobe. The crowds in San Francisco went well for Sadeako, and the newspapers covered her skyrocketing popularity. Eventually the troupe would go on to tour Europe, the Mediterranean, and back to the Far East. She eventually opened her own school to train others to become actresses. Sadeako was truly a woman ahead of her time. If only Hollywood would open their eyes and make a big budget feature on this former international star. We hope you enjoyed this video and will like, share, and subscribe. For more information on Sadeako, you can read 1906 interview with Sadeako conducted by Japanese writer Yon Nagachi. Madame Sadeako the Jisha who bewitched the West by Leslie Downer. 
Or Sadayako, The American Tour, A Dance Chronicle by Shelley Zberg.